Yo, what is up, YouTube? It's your boy, YBP Gang. YBP Nation. YBP Boxing. YBP MMA. Coming at y'all with the tough season 31, episode 7 review. A little later, because I'm not going to lie, I fell asleep during the episode. Um, it's, it's getting that bad, low key. I want to, like, discontinue these, because, you know, the, I mean, the show's just not in anymore, like. Chandler's pretty much just destroying Connor's team at this point. It's not competitive. You can see the better coaching. It's just corny at this point, man. Like the there's no no really storyline there. The intrigue of last episode was kinda gone. Like the one cool thing we thought was, you know, Connor pull up in a Lambo and then, you know, spar. I think he like hurt one of his. Yeah, he definitely hurt them, like with a kick. It was just intense, so so he want to immerse himself in the experience. Just went a little too hard. Um, it's just not hitting like it was the last episode. I had a lot of hope after that last episode. It's pretty good, but I don't know. With this type of stuff, man, I think that's the only thing they had. You know, it definitely wasn't linear. Like, to even when we got there, though. Like, it wasn't like we was up and up and up. And then we got to that point, like. So we can shoot him right back down, man. Like, I must really happen, you know. Um, Landy Quinones, he was another one of my top picks. I ain't even gonna lie, but it just seems like these guys are a little too inexperienced. In the episode, they kind of go. We see like moments with um, him and Connor training and stuff, and then kind of go into his life story. All this type of stuff, and then you see, uh, is it? He's fighting Jason Knight, right? I think so. Um, I can check real quick. Uh, I believe it's Jason Knight. Hmm. I'm sorry about this. Let me see. Yeah. And I think early on in the episode, like, there was, the, uh, from what I remember, because I fell asleep, like, right before the wins. Or right at the wins, pretty much, is when I fell asleep. So I had to go back and rewatch. But um, they had gave him, they told us something about, yeah, spray. I was like, a sprain or a tear in his ligament. And he still fought through that, got the submission in the fight. Um, I think, you know, Kenyonis went for a takedown, you know, round one. And then pretty much just got arm triangle, man, just got caught. You know, just rookie mistakes we're seeing. The the veterans just so much better than these guys. Um, honestly, I was kind of, I was hip to the idea. I liked it. The idea of veterans and um, prospects seemed like a decent idea, but in my mind, I thought it was gonna be like washed veterans, and because we, I mean, they do this all the time in the UFC. They'll match up a rising prospect and they'll match up washed veterans, and you know, hoping the rising prospect wins. But in this case, I don't know if they just didn't get the right prospects, or you know, but they've really only been close to winning once, and that was with Lee Hammond. The other ones have just been, been kind of lopsided, you know? So, and part of that you can't say is Connor's fault. Part of that you can attribute to, like, the 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 style uh, of the of the matchups and, you know, how the teams were uh, uh, formulated and all this type of stuff. But you, you can't lie in your assessment that Connor McGregor could be doing more to help out his team, more to lead, more to take charge. You know, more to be that guy. I mean, you don't have to look too far away to look for a great example of that in Michael Chandler. So, um, it looks like it's going to be 0 for 8. I'm not going to lie. I don't, I'm not really sure. I hope maybe one guy wins, but it's like, I mean, this 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 is pretty much over. So, probably going to be all Chandler guys are all going to be fighting each other. This will be like the first time ever, I think, 
at some point, Connor was asking, like, is there going to be a sweep? I mean, what happens if there's going to be a sweep? And Dana was like, it's never happened. So that's, you know what I mean? That's, I'm just, I don't know, man. I I mean, I, the first early, the earlier episode, man, I was not falling asleep, man. Like, now I can't even really stay awake during some of these episodes, man. It's just getting that bad, you know? But I'm going to still try to keep keep making the videos, but it, I'm not going to lie. It's getting hard, man. It's, it's getting really hard. Um, yeah, but that's all I really got for y'all. Probably going to be it's over 7 with Jason Knight's submission over uh, Landon Quinones with an injury. And it's probably going to be 0 for 8 for Team Chandler. Um, that's all I really got for y'all today. Leave a like on the video, subscribe. Peace out, Moscow. You know what it is. Boo!